Hi everyone, it's Anna, and we are continuing with Car Mechanics Simulator 2021. All right, so let's go ahead and get some orders in. So we have Joanna, referred here by my neighbor. He's a car dealer. I hear that your repair shop has been up and running since quite recently, but you look like a promising mechanic. Wow, well, my buddy doesn't seem to have any problems, but I'll leave that for you to decide. Please change the oil filters, fill missing fluids. I haven't had time for that recently. John mentioned that there was a tapping in the camshaft. Okay, so, oh, yeah, let's take that one too. Let's do this car first and then we'll take care of Joanne's. Okay, so he needs his brakes done. So let's go ahead and move you to our car lift. Beautiful, okay, lift up the car, one more. Okay, beautiful. Go ahead and mark these. Yeah, so this one, okay, unscrew that. I think this caliper needs some help. The rest of this looks okay to me. Okay, and then what other parts? Anything on this one? No, this one looks good. Okay, tire is off. Caliper is off. Ooh, this brake pad also looks a bit rusty, and so does this brake disc. Okay, everything else looks good. All right, take off the wheel. Okay, and the brake pad needs to be gone. Perfect. All right, so two brake pads. Let's buy those. We need a ventilated brake disc. What were the other two? Brake caliper and ABS pump. Brake caliper and then I think the ABS is here. Yeah, this guy. All right, so let's put the tires back together while we're here. Yep, put the nice one in. Brake pad, let's get a new one on there. Brake caliper, and then the tire. Okay, beautiful, that's two out of four. Beautiful. And then this guy did not disassemble because he is good. Let's unmark these and let's get that ABS pump exchanged for a new one. Pop open the hood. Okay, one more. Take off the pump and then let's mount the new one. Oh, it was at like 7% for them. That's not good. All right. Close that. Does he need anything else done? No, it's just brake problems. All right, so let's go ahead and finish this order. He is gone and done. Who else do we have? Let's get this guy. And oh, he needs some paint. And then let me also bring in Joanne's car because she has been waiting for a while. Let's do this car first. He needs just his brakes done. Is that correct? Yeah, and ABS, okay. Well, we can do the ABS module right now while the car is still on the ground. Just pop open his hood, unscrew you. Beautiful, and then let's go ahead and put on the new one. That is done. And then we can lift the car. Okay, beautiful. Caliper off, brake pad off, brake disc off. Add the brake disc to our shopping list. Does this one need work? Yeah, that one needs a new brake pad. That's the only thing this guy needs. Remove you. It's so rusty, it's crazy. Remove that, remove this disc. I think that's it. Okay, cool. So we did the ABS module, let's get rid of that. So we need a brake caliper, brake pads. Okay, let's get what we need. We don't need the electronics shop. We need brakes. So we need one of these, two of the ventilated. We need a brake pad. What was the other thing? Bought two of this one and a brake caliper. Could we sell these things? So we have like all these old things that we don't need. Sell parts that condition is below or equal to 30%. I can tell all the tires that I've kept from messing up because I didn't realize how uh, tires worked in this game. Oh, uh, we can keep these parts. They seem to be okay. Yeah. All right, let's get this car put back together again. Beautiful. That looks much better already. Excellent. This one was good. This one needs to be reassembled. Okay, two out of three. 
three, and then this guy. Screw in the five screws. Oh, I think he is done. Wait, we're missing a brake disc on this one? Oh, it is on this one. Okay. I did not notice that. Oopsies. Oh yeah, that is really rusty. My bad. Okay, now we are good. All right, off you go. And let's go ahead and finally let's get Joanne's car inside the shop. Move the car to car lift A. And you needed, what did you need? Holy moly, part not discovered. Okay, oh boy, wow. Let's just figure it out one thing at a time, right? I wonder if I discovered these parts by just taking the car apart. <laughs> Who knows? What's the easiest thing to do? Oh, the brake pads probably, yeah. Okay, I will take a guess that most of everything I need to do requires the car to be raised. So let's raise it. Okay, looks like those things need to be changed too. Let's get the oil filter removed. What's this blue one? Let's buy that. Let's take care of the tires first because we know how to do that. So we've learned. Okay, beautiful. Oh no, don't take that off. <laughs> Just the brake pad, thank you. And then on this one as well. Okay, let's get those two brake pads. Two, beautiful. Oh, rubber bushing. Okay, I feel like we've dealt with this before. Okay, that's one, two, three, and then, oh, there we go. Okay, beautiful. It was just these four. So let's figure out how to attach them back. Attach, mount, yep, that's much better than the ones that she had previously. Beautiful. Look at us go. Finally learned that I don't have to disassemble the whole entire car for this. So let's unmark the stuff that we have done. So all the rubber bushings. I'm not sure what's wrong with this part. Oh, an oil change. Okay. Got it. Beautiful. So let's unmark those two so they're not being highlighted anymore. Belt tensioner oil filter okay she also wants an oil change so let's actually do that drain the oil let's move that back and we can go ahead and lower the car and let's figure out what to do in here and it looks like the issue is in the engine or is this like a, let's see let's take this oh we can't take that off okay how do we how do you do this? Take the coils out, maybe? Joanne came here trusting us with her car, but I honestly have no idea what the heck is happening. Can we take off the covers now? Okay. Got it. Okay, that one is off. What about the other side? No. Guess take off the oil pan, maybe? Well, I don't know. <laughs> okay, took off something crankshaft bearing cap i wonder if i learn about the parts by disassembling the car okay rod cap the whole car just falls on me um i wouldn't be surprised accessible from engine bay yeah looks like we did the oh this one looks like we got everything from this side right yeah can't do it from here no, everything's from the engine bay, so let's go ahead and lower the car. Oh, Joanne, what are you doing with your car? Maybe the throttle, whatever this is for? This is like last time. I bet I don't even have to disassemble all of this. Oh, you know what? We are disassembling it. So I can figure out what the heck is going on. There has to be a reason why I can't remove this right now. And I don't understand what that reason is. Maybe I have to take all of these 
fuel injectors out. Timing chain. The cam gear here too. Okay, so this light is like released from what it looks like. Can I focus on you for a second? Uh, no, focus on this. Yeah, what is blocking you from coming out? Maybe this roller? Okay. But that doesn't help me. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, got the belt off. There we go. I can take the cover off now, thank goodness. Okay, with the cover off, let's add these pieces to our shopping list. Let's take off this tensioner. Oh, okay. Okay, the belt. And then the roller. Okay, so the parts we need to repair are off, right? No, wrong. Add that to my shopping list real quick. Let's go ahead and disassemble this. Take out the screw. Take out this guy as well. Take out all these screws. What am I taking off? Camshaft cap. Okay. So many caps on this. Which I guess is good, because it is a car engine. Okay, can we remove it? Wait, do we need to replace this one? No, it's just the other one. Oh, why did I spend so much time unscrewing it? Oh no. Oh, this is bad. Okay. My bad. What is in there? Spark plug. Okay, let's get that out. That looks rusty. Oh, one more here. Oops. There we go. Okay, beautiful. I don't even know if I was supposed to take out the spark plug, but whatever. We have two spark plugs that we do need to change. I don't believe I took this one out. No, I did not. Okay. So let's go shopping for parts. Okay, cam gear. Cam gear, I-14, this one. So I need two of them. An idle roller. Can't not type. Idle roller A. Got it. Oh no. I think it. <laughs> I thought it was like a list. Deleted the things I needed. Anyway, let's go ahead and get a belt tensioner. Camshaft. Uh, Camshaft. <laughs> Camshaft. This one. Engine head. Engine head I4. Wow, no, I don't need an engine. I don't need this. Before I buy everything that I don't need anymore, let's get some spark plugs. We need two. Beautiful. And a belt tensioner. Perfect. Let's get to reassembling this. Mount parts. I don't think we needed to take this off, but that's fine. Now we know. That is on, and let's get the spark plug in, and then one more. Let's get the new camshaft in there, and let's cap them. Okay, all the caps are in. Let's get this guy in. Beautiful. Put our rollers back in. It's got a new serpentine belt. Serpentine belt A. Hope there's not more than one. Oh no, I bought the wrong one. <laughs> oh gosh, okay. Belt A. This one. Apologies for that. Yep. Beautiful. Get the belt tensioner in cover on. Okay, so we got the tensioner. We have idle roller A. Oil filter and ignition coil. Why oh, is this showing up still? Oh, I needed to change that one too. Oh no. That's my bad. Okay. 
Okay, I kind of had to go in re disassemble a couple of things to really understand what I was doing wrong, and it just turns out that I was looking at the wrong thing. <laughs> it's my bad. Um, so we can go ahead and continue reassembling this guy. Put on the cover. This is the ignition coil that I was like trying to figure out wh what I'm missing on it. Um, I like didn't realize that the ignition coil goes on top after reassembling everything. So I kept disassembling thinking that I'm going crazy. So all of this is done. We probably do need to top off the fluids because I uh, kind of spilled everything. Let's go ahead and lift up the car and let's put in the filter. Okay, beautiful. And then let's lower the car down. And it looks like everything I've discovered is there. I'm not, I'm not entirely sure what these parts are and they're not showing up as an area to discover. So I'm just going to leave them. But it looks like she wants new oil and to drain all the, all the fluids and just get some refills done. So let's go ahead and top off those for her. Refill the coolant now that I've like spilled everything. Okay, nothing there. So then let's go ahead and take off the cap, pour in some new coolant. Okay. And then same thing with the window washer. Cool. And then her oil. Oh, we forgot to put that back on the oil pan. I realized how many parts I took off, and uh, if I hadn't remembered, I feel like Joanne would have to be uh, <laughs> driving home with a lot of problems. I forgot that I had disassembled this part too. Who would have known? One more. Okay, now I can put on the oil pan. I thought I like messed up completely. I was just missing a bunch of parts. This is somehow worse than last time when I disassembled the entire bottom of the car. <laughs> oh dear. Now we can go ahead and take off the oil plug and put new oil in the car. Yay! Beautiful. Are we done with it all? Yeah. Okay. I don't know where these parts are. She's gonna have to figure it out herself. <laughs> Alright, so let's go ahead and close this. Wait, we can't stop it? What? we have to discover what else is wrong? Wait, how do we do that? I don't know, we can examine her car and stuff. It's cool. Ah, cool. So this is, I wonder if this is how we uncover like car parts or something, figure out what's wrong. Cool. Okay, I'm gonna park this car here for now. It is driving me crazy. Um, I have a few parts that are not discovered so I'm gonna go ahead and take a different order. Let's work on this blue car first. Okay, so brake calipers, brake disc, brake pads. I always need these, so let's just buy however many we need. And then let's go ahead and get the car raised. A little bit more, thank you. Okay, it's the other three tires, got it.
Oh, that is so rusty. Ooh. Yikes. Okay. Let's put on the new parts. Break disc. Brake pad. Caliper. Sport tire. Okay, beautiful. One is done. This is so much easier than Joanne's car. Okay, break the caliper off. And then let's put on the new one. Okay, beautiful. And then just the disc here. Okay, off with the disc. And then let's reassemble it. Cool. And looks like we are done with this order. Goodbye, car. Oh, well, let's try it. This is something different. I don't know how it's going to go, but let's try it out. Outer tie rod spring cap. Okay, so let's bring you into car lift A. Accessible from the wheel side. Okay, and then where is the other thing that is wrong? Under the car. Okay, got it. So let's lift you up and let's start disassembling this. Did I not have to disassemble my car? Probably didn't. And where was this other piece? It's in here. Okay. I would need to remove this suspension arm. Okay, I'll come back to that. Let me just get the piece that I need. Spring cap and outer tie rod. Spring cap. Outer tie rod. Beautiful. Let's put it back. Okay, beautiful. And then this part down here. Take off the cap. Okay, this was much easier. I did not make it complicated. That's probably what helped. <laughs> Let's put in the new spring cap, the spring, and then the shock absorber. Okay, cool. I think that does it for this car. Can we move the car to the car wash? I want to try washing a car. I know they didn't ask for this, but I want this. How do we operate this? Look how beautiful it is inside now. And then let's go ahead and wash this car so it looks pretty too. That actually looks much better. Can we like get rid of this car? <laughs> Ugh, I'm not sure what to do. Or is this car? Move you here for now. What does this do? Oh, it looks at all the parts. Okay. That's cool. Still doesn't tell me what I need to do with this. Um, I don't know if part not discovered means like there's something else I haven't looked at or something. I don't know. I want to finish Joanne's car. That's my goal. But Joanne over here, her car is clearly just, who knows what's wrong with it, right? Her car is just not functioning well. Let's lift it up one more time. I'm just going to run around and see if I can find anything that needs some help. Um, someone said, look for things that are really rusty. Maybe she just really needs these replaced. Okay, let's see if that helps. Put on the caliper. Did 
Does that help even a little bit? Oh, it did. It definitely was her tires. Okay, so then there's one more thing that needs some help. These don't look as rusty. Oh, yeah, this one. Thank you to Reddit for telling me to just look for very rusty parts on her car. Oh, yeah, just her tires, her brake pad, and then this guy. Oh, Joanne. Just really sent me on an adventure with your car. I'm glad to know that there's a possibility of finding like things that aren't on the list of complaints or the list of tasks to do. Okay, I think Joanne is complete now. You are. Goodbye, Joanne. I need 2,000 coins for that. Oh, Joanne, why? Okay, cool. All right, guys, and that's it for this video. Thank you for bearing with me as I disassemble more cars and have no idea what I'm doing. Um, I really appreciate it and thank you for being here. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.